Lord, reaching down from heaven in some of your lives. He did before. He's going to do it again. Some of you will resonate, will testify with me, will identify with me. That in the midst of the persecution, the resistance of your faith, even the persecution from your own self, some of us from families, from workplaces, from tribes, from leadership, from politics. It took the Lord to turn a light brighter than the noonday light to capture the attention of Paul. And there are things resisting you. There are roadblocks and, 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 and things that are hindering your progress. There are things that you have failed to overcome. It's going to not take religion. It, it will not take this church. It will not take your family. It will not take your husband or wife. It won't take your father or mother. In my case, they all failed. No, it won't take your church. It will take the intervention of Almighty God in a mighty way for you to walk to freedom. And you see, we always leave it a halfway. The, the, the circuit is not complete. When we say the intervention of the Almighty God, people will say, oh, that's, that's an open check. Then, then, then God is going to do something. Then I, I just have to wait. It will take the intervention of God as and when you cooperate with Him. Get that one. God will cooperate, will do things for you, will lift you out of the mouth of the devourer of the lions when you cooperate.